Good morning, love train. Well, it's another day. Uh, I got some stuff to do today. I think I'm going to wash the dreads today because I think my scalp by now is like, it needs to be done, you know. Um, and then I am going to go and pay the phone bill. Woo! I hate paying bills. Anybody else feel me on that? Because I just hate giving my money away. Sucks. It just it just irritates me to like no end, which is I guess a good thing um, that my all my bills like electricity and all the utilities and stuff like that are included in my rent because if they weren't then I would have to that would be just more bills that I would have to pay and I would hate it. So I'm glad for that I guess. But man, I hate paying bills. But I'm pretty sure if I don't pay the bill today, then both Sarah and I's phones are getting turned off, so better do it. Um, anyways, that's about it. And then work again later. I was able to vlog a lot at work yesterday, so if you haven't seen yesterday's video yet, you need to go back and look at it, because it definitely gives you like a good glimpse of um, what being in a restaurant all the time is like so hopefully I'll get better and better at that um let's get in the shower OMG it's exciting news it's Memorial Day and so Verizon's not gonna be open today so as far as I'm concerned I don't have to go pay my phone bill today isn't that right I think that's the rules I think it is. So, dreadlocks are washed. Ah, feeling cleansed, feeling good. Dreadlocks are so spiritual. I'm glad that I have them. Like, even when I'm washing them, I don't know, it just feels so spiritual. It feels like being cleansed. Weird. I just like it. Um, so, Sarah texted me, and she and Ralph are hitting the beach today, and I think that that's a pretty great Memorial Day plan. I don't have to work till 5, so I'm going to hit the beach too. Uh, I'm going to get my beach bag together, I'm going to pack my work clothes, and I'm even going to put makeup on, because I know I'm not going to get my face wet at the beach, and I might as well just have my face like ready for work so I can just go like directly from the beach to work I don't have to waste any beach time on coming back here so yeah it's gonna be a good day although honestly my house is on the way to work from the beach maybe I'll just leave my work clothes here and just put my makeup on that's what I'll do ha ah, beach planning I'm like I get so much anxiety when planning to go to the beach and that makes no sense at all like getting anxiety planning for relaxation this is so silly oh well i better get moving all right guys it's time to go try and meet up with sarah and ralph but first i have to stop at the store and get some supplies i brought my beach chair finally because i'm never in the mood to haul this thing out but last time sarah and ralph were like where's your beach chair it's beach chair season it's summer get it together so I brought my beach chair this time let's go to the store and get some beach snacks and stuff all right went to the store got some goodies for the beach and now we're gonna see if Sarah and Ralph are home all right here we are at the beach it's gonna be such a great day hopefully I can get some relaxation in before I go to work today. Yay! Dark because you can't see cell phones in the sunlight. And it's the 
invisible. <laughs> All right, guys, beach day is over. It's kind of abruptly over because guess who is supposed to work at four today? Me. Guess what time it is? Five o'clock. <laughs> guess where I'm going? Work. So, I hate it when this happens. I feel so rushed and just panicked. I hate being late to anything. Ask anybody who knows me and I just, they'll tell you. I, I really, really freaking hate it. And it was my bad. I read the schedule wrong, so bad on me. Ugh, I hate, ha I hate having to, like, wait tables and having to, like, show up for a job. It just freaking sucks, but it's the way of the world. Let's go. Here I am at work. I hate this. I hate coming in late. Ah, oh, I feel so panicked and rushed. Oh my god. I hope the place is set up when I go in there. Oh my god. It was a nightmare. There was tables the second I came in here. So I've been rushing around trying to like set the restaurant up at the same time that I'm waiting tables. And now I'm all caught up finally. And so I've had a moment to come here to the bathroom and put my hair up correctly the way it's supposed to be for waiting tables and just chill out and take a minute. So that's what I'm doing. <sighs> Never ever show up to work late. It's the worst thing ever. Oh good lord. I'm done with work and it was just crazy. Oh, today was the wrong day to show up late, that is for sure, because I had a hard time the whole night long. But luckily, I was able to still give people like good service and like get them everything that they needed. So, oh my god, the life of a waitress. Ah, I made like $135 tonight. <laughs> and I mean, this is just a tiny restaurant. I normally do not make that much, like, so just crazy. Oh, I'm excited to be done with it. Right now I'm waiting on Sarah and Ralph to text me and tell me what they're doing. Um, and then we'll see what happens after that. I really don't know. Okay guys, it is time for me to go to bed. I am very, very tired and it's three in the morning because this is what I do. I just stay up late and watch YouTube videos and all kinds of stupid shit like that. Um, but anyways, I sure do hope that you guys enjoyed today's video as crazy as today was. Um, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe and jump on the love train with us. Woo woo! Also, come follow me on Facebook at facebook.com slash lilhipster, just the way I spell it here on my channel. Um, I'm also on Twitter, Tumblr, and Instagram, so come find me out there. I would love to have you. You guys have a wonderful night, and don't forget to eat your fruits and vegetables. Bye-bye.